You want first want to make sure that it's a swab specifically for the clarinet. You want to make sure that it is a thin material, that it is not thick. Silk is the best kind that you could probably use. Most swabs are going to come with a weight at the bottom of it, and you are going to put the weight into the barrel and then allow the swab to work its way down so it's coming out the bell. Now I want you to notice that I don't have a mouthpiece on my clarinet right now, and that's because we don't swab our mouthpieces. If we swab our mouthpieces, then the swab over time can damage the inside of the mouthpiece, and that can change how we sound. And so you wanna make sure you take off the mouthpiece first. Once the swab string is all the way through, you wanna make sure that the swab isn't bunched up at all because that can um, increase the chances of it getting caught on the inside. And then you just gently pull through, and that's how you swab. I know some people who swab their instruments bell first, and there was also a point in time when I would swab my clarinet, um, I would take it apart and I would swab each joint individually. And really the most important thing about swabbing your instrument is that you do it after every time you play. Don't skip it. It's a really important part of maintaining your clarinet.